EOS 2025.05. Embracing Qt 6 and enhancing the KDE experience. Release date, May 27, 2025. KOS, the independent KDE-focused Linux distribution, has unveiled its latest stable release, KOS 2025.05. This version marks a significant milestone by fully transitioning to Qt 6, offering users a modern, streamlined, and efficient desktop environment. Key highlights, complete transition to Qt. 6, KOS 2025.05 eliminates Qt 5 from its default installation, ensuring that all core applications and frameworks are built on the latest QTS 6.9.0. While Q5 remains available in the repositories for now, its complete removal is planned in the near future. Updated KDE ecosystem, Plasma 6.3.5, delivers a polished and responsive desktop experience. KDE Gear 25th, April 1, introduces enhancements such as Dolphin File Manager now supports right-to-left languages like Arabic and Hebrew. KRDC offers improved scaling and authentication features. Ocular now supports PGP slash GPG based digital signatures. Falcon Browser gains the ability to block WebSockets. Framework 6.140 provides a robust foundation for KDE applications. System enhancements upgraded to Linux kernel 6.14.8 with updates to essential components like GCC 14.2.1, Glib 2.4.1, and Pacman 7.0.0. Transitioned to Phonon MPV as the default sound backend, ensuring full Qt6 compatibility. SDDM 0.20 now offers the option to run in Wayland mode, moving closer to a complete Wayland environment. File system support introduced experimental support for the BCA Chef's file system, with necessary tools available in the repositories. Calamari's installer now supports automated partitioning with popular file systems like XFS, EXT4, BTRFS, and ZFS. Enhanced user experience, Journal. A new GUI tool for viewing system logs, simplifying troubleshooting and system monitoring. Croiso, the welcome application assists users in configuring their new installation, offering customization options and package selection. Midna theme, updated artwork and icon themes provide a cohesive and modern visual experience. Installation notes, KOS uses the systemd provided systemd boot for UEFI installs. The ISO uses the CRC and PhenoBT enabled XFS file system as default, enhancing error detection and crash recovery. Installing on RAID is currently not possible. To create reliable installation media, avoid using Unetbootin or Rufus. DVDs need a burn speed no higher than 4x. Conclusion KOS 2025.05 represents a significant step forward in delivering a modern, efficient, and user-friendly Linux distribution. With its complete transition to Qt 6, updated KDE components, and enhanced system features, KOS continues to provide a streamlined and cohesive desktop experience. Download KOS 2025.05. Visit the official KOS website to download the latest ISO and access detailed installation instructions. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out everybody and don't forget I'll be posting videos daily without missing any day. So don't forget to like my content, share my content on all social media platforms so we can build a larger Linux community and conquer the world with love. And finally, don't forget to subscribe to my everyday content. Bye, have a wonderful day.